There are more scales than just the major and minor scale. One of those scales is very useful in electronic music and hip hop styles, the Dorian mode. A mode is just another term for a scale. Modes are the predecessors to our modern scales. In fact, the major and minor scale were once just two of many modes. Let's take our major scale. When we start on the first note and go up an octave, we have the scale. You're probably familiar with this idea. But we could start on any one of the other notes. For example, let's start on the second note, D, and go up an octave. This is a new scale. This is a mode, the Dorian mode. Take any major scale, start on the second note of the scale, and that will be the Dorian mode. Since each scale has seven notes, we could do this same thing on each of those seven notes giving us seven different modes. Let me show you each of those seven modes while keeping C as the root note. C is the one of C major. If we use the notes of C major and go from C to C, we get the Ionian mode, or what we call today the major scale. C is the second of B flat major. Using the notes of B flat major, if we go from C to C, we get the Dorian mode. C is the third of A flat major. If we use the notes of A flat major and go from C to C, we get what's called the Phrygian mode, which is a type of minor scale. C is the fourth of G major. If we use the notes of G major and go from C to C, we get what's called the Lydian mode, a major scale variant often referred to as the brightest mode. C is the fifth of F major. Using the notes of F major, going from C to C, we get what's called the Mixolydian mode, a mode that's heavily used in blues, although it is not the blues scale. C is the sixth of E flat major. By using the notes of E flat major, when we go from C to C, we get what's called the Aeolian mode, or what we call today the minor scale. C is the seventh of D flat major. Using the notes of D flat major, when we go from C to C, we get what's called the Locrian mode. As you can probably see from the names of these modes, they're from a much earlier point in musical history. Since we're going to be using the Dorian mode for the rest of this video, I'll show you a more direct way to create it. Take the major scale, lower the third note and the seventh note by one semitone. Now you have the Dorian mode. Patreon is where you can download the stems, as well as other materials from the videos on this channel, project files, samples, and more. Also, if you'd like to take a one-on-one -on -one session, email me at jaronlessons at gmail.com for rates and scheduling. All the links and info are in the description. As always, stay musical, and I'll see you next time.